Ammo reloading. What's the big deal? Right, let's talk ammo reloading. It's a fascinating process that many gun enthusiasts swear by. It's like baking a cake, but instead of a sweet treat, you get bullets. Imagine the precision and care that goes into baking. It's the same here. You take all the bits and bobs, the bullet, the casing, the primer, the powder, and you put them together just right. Each component has to be perfect. Now, why would anyone do this? What's the appeal? Can't you just buy ammo at the store? Of course you can. But there's more to it. Reloading lets you control everything. The type of bullet, how much powder, how it all fits together. It's about customization and precision. Think of it like making a smoothie. You can buy one pre-made, but making your own lets you choose the fruits, adjust the sweetness, and get it exactly how you like it. You can tailor it to your taste, your dietary needs, and your preferences. Reloading is the same. It's about getting ammo that's perfect for you and your gun. Reloading is the same. It's about getting ammo that's perfect for you and your gun. It's a personal touch that makes a big difference. And just like baking, reloading needs to be done right. Precision is key. You need the right tools, the right ingredients, and most importantly, you need to follow the recipe to the letter. Every step matters. Safety is paramount, and we'll get into all that later. It's crucial to understand the importance of each step to ensure everything is done safely and correctly. So why go through the hassle of reloading? Well, for many folks, it's about saving money. Ammo can be pricey, especially if you like to shoot regularly. The costs can add up quickly. Reloading lets you buy components in bulk, which often ends up being cheaper in the long run. You can stock up on supplies and save more. It's like buying a big bag of flour instead of those tiny, expensive ones at the supermarket. Makes sense, right? The savings are significant. But it's not just about saving pennies. There's more to it. Reloading also gives you control over your ammo's performance. You can customize it to your needs. You can fine-tune it for accuracy, ensuring each shot is precise. Adjust it for different guns, making sure each firearm performs at its best. Even create specialized rounds for hunting or competition. Tailor your ammo to your specific needs. It's like having a tailor-made suit. It fits you perfectly because you chose the fabric and the fit. Customization is key. And trust me, there's a certain satisfaction that comes with hitting your target dead on with ammo you made yourself. It's a rewarding experience. Now before you go mixing gunpowder in your basement, let's talk about getting started. The first step is research, research, research. There are tons of resources out there. Books, websites, forums, all dedicated to reloading. Find a mentor, someone experienced who can show you the ropes. Just like learning to bake from your granny, having someone guide you is invaluable. Next, you'll need to invest in some equipment. A reloading press is your workhorse, and there are different types depending on your needs. You'll also need dies, which are specific to the caliber you're reloading. Think of it like baking tools. You need a good mixer, measuring cups, and the right baking pan. Don't worry, we'll talk more about the essential tools later. Now, before we go any further, we need to have a serious chat about safety. Reloading involves handling explosive materials, and it's crucial to treat it with the utmost respect. First and foremost, always wear safety glasses. You don't want a stray primer or a bit of powder anywhere near your eyes. A well-ventilated area is also crucial. Those fumes from the primers and powder? Not good for your lungs. Always follow the reloading manual's instructions precisely. Think of it like a doctor's prescription. You don't mess with the dosage, right? And never, ever smoke or have open flames anywhere near your reloading bench. Remember, safety is paramount. Treat reloading with the seriousness it deserves, and you'll be just fine. Section 5. Picking Your Tools – The Reloading Starter Kit 
All right, let's talk tools. Whether you're a seasoned reloader or just starting out, having the right tools is crucial. Just like a good mechanic needs their wrenches, reloaders need their gadgets. These tools are the backbone of your reloading process. The most important tool is the reloading press, your trusty sidekick. It's the heart of your reloading setup. It's what you use to resize cases, seat primers, and everything in between. Without it, reloading would be nearly impossible. You'll also need dies, which are like molds for your ammo. They ensure each round is perfectly shaped and sized. Each caliber has its own set of dies. This means you'll need different dies for different types of ammunition. A powder scale is essential for measuring out the right amount of powder. Remember, precision is key. Accurate measurements ensure safety and performance. Other handy tools include a case trimmer, a primer pocket cleaner, and a caliper for measuring. These tools help maintain the quality and consistency of your reloads. It might seem like a lot, but trust me, the right tools make all the difference. A well-organized workspace with the right tools can make reloading a breeze. Think of it like investing in good quality baking sheets and mixing bowls. They'll last you a lifetime. Just as in cooking, having reliable tools in reloading ensures better results and a more enjoyable experience. Section 6. Reloading Recipes Following the cookbook. Remember those reloading manuals we talked about? Well, they're like cookbooks for your ammo. They contain recipes, but instead of flour and sugar, you've got powder charges and bullet seeding depths. Each recipe is specific to a particular caliber and bullet type. It tells you exactly how much powder to use, how deep to seat the bullet, and other crucial details. Following the recipe ensures your ammo is safe and performs as intended. Don't be tempted to experiment or deviate from the recipe. Just like you wouldn't add extra chili flakes to your granny's famous cookie recipe, stick to the recommended guidelines for safe and reliable ammo. Section 7. Common Mistakes. Oops, I did it again. Even experienced reloaders make mistakes sometimes. It's important to be aware of common pitfalls and how to avoid them. One common mistake is double charging a case, putting in twice the amount of powder. This can have disastrous consequences, so always double check your powder charges. Another mistake is using the wrong components. Make sure your primers, powder, and bullets are all compatible with the caliber you're reloading. And always inspect your cases for damage before reloading them. Remember, reloading is all about precision. Pay attention to detail, Follow the instructions carefully, and don't be afraid to ask for help if you're unsure about something. Section 8. The payoff benefits of rolling your own. So, why go through all this trouble of reloading? Well, the benefits are numerous. First and foremost, it can save you a pretty penny, especially if you're a frequent shooter. But the real beauty of reloading lies in the customization. You can tailor your ammo to your specific needs. Want ammo that's super accurate for long range shooting? No problem. Need a specific load for competition? You got it. Reloading gives you the flexibility to create ammo that's perfectly suited for your gun and your shooting style. It's like having a bespoke suit. It fits you perfectly because you chose the fabric and the fit. Section nine, finding your tribe, reloading communities. One of the best things about reloading is the community. There are countless online forums, clubs, and groups dedicated to this hobby. It's a great way to connect with fellow reloaders, share tips, and learn from each other. These communities are a treasure trove of information. You can find answers to your questions, get advice on equipment, and even share your reloading experiences. So don't be shy. Reach out and join a community. It's like having a whole team of baking buddies all eager to share their recipes and secrets. Section 10, final thoughts. Is reloading right for you? 
Reloading is a rewarding hobby that can save you money, improve your shooting accuracy, and provide a sense of satisfaction. However, it's not for everyone. It requires patience, attention to detail, and a commitment to safety. If you're willing to put in the time and effort, reloading can be an incredibly rewarding experience. But if you're short on time, easily distracted, or uncomfortable handling potentially dangerous materials, then reloading might not be the best fit for you. Ultimately, the decision is yours. Just remember, whether you choose to reload or stick to factory ammo, the most important thing is to enjoy your shooting hobby safely and responsibly.